Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Gatomu Pro Wrestling YouTube channel. Today we are at Ichikaya Chocolate Square, Gatomu home ground in Tokyo, Japan, for a tag team action. We have the team of Seika Obihiro and Antonio Honda on the left in the blue colors against the team of Yuna Mitsumori and Saki on the right in green and yellow. They are the Asia Dream Tag Team Champions and the referee for this match is Ruho's older sister Sena. The match starts with Saki and Honda exchanging the shoulder tackles. Again with the shoulder tackles. This match was from the 17th of August 2019. We have about 60 fans at a hot summer in Tokyo. Honda hits Saki to the foot, running Saki counters, goes to the back, Honda reverse with the wrestling hole, lifts Saki up, move to the back, running for the big shooter attackers, nice move by Saki, look at that. Tagging in her partners, Yuna Mitsumori. Honda tried to tag his partner, Sayaka Obihiro, and he tagged. Drop kick, miss. Yuna Mong with the body press, escape by Obihiro. Try to hit the strike to Mitsumori. Mitsumori roll to the audience. Saki hit with a big boot. Nice teamwork, nice game plan. And then Yuna Mong keep rolling on the mat. Right now to the back of Sega Obihiro. Lift Obihiro head up. Tagging in Saki. Saki lift Obihiro up with a big body slam. And then just keep rolling on her body just like her partner in a missionary. Now with the covers. Obihiro shoulders up. The match continue. Saki is one of the most powerful wrestlers that wrestler for Gatomu Pro Wrestling and I think she is a tag team specialist so she has a good experience to wrestlers at a tag team in Ichikaya Chocolate Square right now Saki try to move over her hands like Ben Honda hit the bionic elbows make fun of her opponent right now with the covers still kick out she looks so fun it's fun to watch. Here comes Junamon. She is the idol, so she adapts a lot of idol cultures into her wrestling stars. And she did it very well. She became the fan favorite. Saki take Honda out and again with the submission. No, it's kind of the double team. Just leave Obihiro in the air and swing like a Viking. This is Saki's signature move. So when she tagged with Junomong, Junomong lift Obihiro up in the kind of the Boston Crab position. Very interesting move. Control the match completely by the Asia Dream Tag Team Champion. But this match is the non-title match anyway. Junomong keep moving. Playing with fans, running for... Her signature move, Mists, Obihiro escape, go for the strike block by Junomong. Look at that, she keep rolling Obihiro hands and spin it out, full Nelson. And hit mistake, Obihiro with the reversals, hit with the dribble from Dub Kick. Making a hot tag to Antonio Honda. Will this be it? Honda a shot to the chest. Forcing with star again with shots. Audience in the Shikaya Chocolate Square, the audience the front row connect to the mat. So they can hear the sound clearly, they can see the strike clearly. So I think Ichikaya Shokara Square is one of the most unique and entertaining wrestling environment in the world. Try to buck up the muscles before they can fight each other again. Look at that. Hit to the throat. It's become like a devastating move. Yunamong right now in the troubles. 
Honda Eilish Whip. Send Junomon face first to the wall running. Shoulder tackles. She says she's part of the power fighters of Gato Move. Look at that. Can she take Antonio Honda, the veteran down? Drop kick. And she nails it. Honda back first to the mat with the cover still keep out. Junomon. Lift. Honda up in the Alabama Slam position for her signature to Ropikuru Yako. Can she lift up uh, Honda up? And she can. Try to put Honda to the wall. Big move by Junomon. The momentum is now on hers. While running, counter with the both knees. We are in the climax. They give everything into this match. Anything can happen at Ichikaya Shokala Super. Tagging in Obihiro and here comes Saki. Drop kick by Obihiro. Big boot by Saki. Obihiro hit with the forearm strike. Saki again with a strike. Obihiro with the rolling forearm. Obihiro improved a lot after she returned from a long hair test after the injuries. In the past few months, she showed a lot of the technique, showed a lot of skills and I can wait to see more of Obihiro. Maybe we can start with this match? Maybe. Saiki lift for the big brain buster. Her signature move to the top. Body place, the Konnichiwa place, but missed. Obihiro. Go for the Obihiro magic. He's spinning, confusing the opponent and spinning. Reverse by Saiki. It's a near fall. Nice reversal by Saiki. Big boot. Obihiro hit with the roaring forearms. Spinning forearm strike and lock in the front face lock Saiki with the reversals. Obihiro from behind. Here comes Antonio Honda. Be careful of that. Obihiro lift Saiki up and hit with the good bridge. Junomon break the cover just in time and Honda helping his partners what she's planning to do. I think it's time for the signature bionic elbow. Just like Dusty Rose, the fists are ready and hit to the side of the neck. Upload opponent keep roaring, dancing, countered by the tag team champions. It's the champion's turn. Roaring, roaring, dancing, dancing. Kicked by the blue team. Charging and just try to ease others. It looks interesting and dancing, roaring. Who gonna get it? Let's see who gonna take the action first. Reversal by the tag team champion, so Obihiro and Honda just punching to each other's. Their hands still keep roaring. Be careful, it's time for the slingshot. Again, they fight each other's. I don't know why they cannot stop their arms. But this is a good advantage for the tag team champions. Obihiro is now in trouble. Lift Obihiro up for the double team move. The back body drop. Tropical Yahoo. Yunomong take Honda out. And the Konnichiwa place. Nice move. One, two, three. Saki and Yuna Mitsumuri get the victories. And if you enjoyed the move for wrestling, please subscribe to our channel. Until next time, bye bye.